Good morning, world. Welcome to day two here in Louisiana. Um, well, after eight o'clock, the nice gentleman, Keith, um, offered us to take his open trailer so we can uh, go wash our race car. So ideally, the plan is to go wash the race car and at least have it clean. <laughs> um, not raceable right now. Pretty sure the motor is just kaputsy. Done. But it'll be good to have it cleaned. So we're gonna go to the car wash, clean her up. Then tonight we head to Arc La Tax. And I know Michael probably roll his eyes at this one, but I'm Becky on Arc La Tex. Stands for Arkansas, Louisiana, Texas. Because we are literally like at the border of all three. Right? It only makes sense. It only seems logistic. So, yeah, not too bad of a morning. Not good of a night last night. So, got the big block tonight, hoping she's tacky and fast and we'll have the right package. So it looks like they have the car unloaded already. Just in time. Morning. Morning. Hi. Do you want to go into the walk? Uh, bye. Between all the chaos last night, poor Mike, new suit, huge rip. That sucks. It's a new one too. So, a few change of plans already. Um, well, one, airing out the suit over there for something that probably a lot of you guys don't think about is when you race five days straight, most drivers typically have just one uniform and don't really have a place to wash it. So, luckily Mike has two or three one with a hole in it, but airing it out. I'm gonna find out if this place has a washing machine. At least, I don't know, I'm thinking, we'll see, we'll see. So anyways, so, I was meeting my hair, but my hands are full. Um, but Keith's son and their buddy, I can't deal with it, don't mind me, um, came, picked up the car, and luckily for my sake, there's not enough room in the truck. So I'm going back to the hotel, gonna edit yesterday's video, have myself a tizzy, tea and a fizz, get some work done, and let the boys wash her up, and maybe I'll see if we have, uh, I don't know, don't hotels usually have washer and dryers? So you thought of us, you took one video, appreciate it. How was, how was scrub a dub time? Talking to you. No, you're I'm not talking, talking to me. Art, Art's all the way over there. Yeah. How am I supposed to know you're talking to me? <laughs> Usually I'm you talking. were just Usually literally I'm talking, talking to myself. your phone to I someone else. <laughs> uh, it was great. Uh, the Body Ollie crew uh, come over and uh, brought an open trailer and we we can't get this big rig in, into the car wash, so uh, they helped us unload and get the get the car over the car wash, wash it up. It was muddy. Mm. Wow, they got some thick clay down here. Dude, what'd you do to There's Art? Light in it. Does he have tape just stuck to him, or did he actually hurt himself? Oh, <laughs> what'd you do, Art? I um uh, walk on the ladder. Oh, that guy. The upper ladder. Yeah. Man, did you see the battle scar he's got on his nose? He's not gonna go back in one piece. I have a feeling. So anyways, so now we are heading a big plastic bag. Oh no. So now we are heading to get lunch at 11 a.m. because there's nothing else to do and there's no food on our way to the racetrack. 
and they open 11 and I am dressed far too warm for this beautiful weather. Oh, gosh. But, Mexico, here we come. What did we all get? This guy went with the crawfish. Hey. And look at this, Mike. It's like a taco pocket or something. What is, what is it called? Um, I don't know, but I thought I got two hard tacos. So. <laughs> they are hard. They are. <laughs> Someone do a head count. Someone's already in the bathroom after Mexican. Wait, where did Nate go? Oh, he's out there. That was like head count, both are missing. But Art's in there ready. We're getting ready to hit the road. I hope he puts a seatbelt on in the toilet. Did you install one of those? That probably wouldn't be a bad idea. So, I mean, I I really enjoyed uh, lunch. Michael, did you? It was awesome. Very good. Some kind of Nikki's, weird name, Nikki's Mexican Some kind of Nikki's. Well, it was called Nikki's. Nikki's. We are off to Arc Latex West. Now, this is whoa, a bayou. Like, oh, oh, wow. there's trees just chilling out there. See any alligators? I want to see a gator. imagine what could possibly be in this pond and of course of course your girls gotta go scoop it out yeah, I ain't seen much movement don't really expect them to with all this noise we're making but gotta see a gator man gotta see a gator I have not been getting all of my fruits and veggies in so getting this and my probiotics because it's starting to feel a major lag here. So gotta listen to your body guys. Always listen to your body. Your body knows what it needs and your girl's body needs some greens. <laughs> you know. Mr. Art, what you doing up there? Taking some weight off ah. of a car, not me. Uh, I was gonna say you're not helping very much. Well, not just one arm's getting skinny. Oh, okay, all right, good. Things are getting pretty serious in there. 
took his shoes off. I've seen some things in my day, but not a school bus water truck. That is pretty nifty. So just updated my list for the year. This is race number 92 and the 33rd different track I've been to all season. It offered up it, but I got this, I'm breaking out. My throat's starting to get sore. I think my list is telling me that it's time for off season. <laughs> my body cannot keep up with this. Oh my God. Uh, so, um, I don't know how you guys are, but me, I kind of like to escape once in a while. I mean, as much as I love seeing everyone and meeting everyone, just being around the races, sometimes you really just need to kind of hide, disappear, kind of like unplug for a little bit. So I'm currently watching you guys. Gotta check out these trucks. Tow trucks? I'm not really sure. Push trucks? A little bit, little bit of recliners? A little bit of everything right now? This is my uh, peace and quiet serenity for the evening before all hellfire breaks loose, so you gotta check these guys out. Hi Mike. Alright. You putting the good stickers on the race car? Or are you it's just... A profanity. A profanity? Oh hello, Ari. You putting profanity on the race car? Remove them. Cover it up with yeah. the panel. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they yelled us for that profanity. Yeah. Now we gotta make our doors a little bit taller. Just a wee bit. Well, guys, I wasn't looking and I think I just woke up the colony. Oh, cranky. You don't see this stuff in Jersey. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Hi. Enter in turn four. Uh, when you exit the track, you come off the back stretch. There's dual roads there. Um, if you're going to go to the scale, we need you to enter the scale shed on this side and then roll through. Uh, That's a good number. I like that number. That's a good one. All right. So we have weather in the forecast. So just high drivers meeting at five, hot lips are gonna be at 5.30, and we are gonna push this show along.
God, my heart just dropped. Literally, like, I mean, his car looked like it was hard handling, but fast. And literally just drives straight off of turn three, and it's a drop. Straight into the wall. Whole front end caved in. I mean, junk. That frame is junk. Wow. Glad he's okay. Shepard's leading. I don't know what happened. Looks like they're messing with something up under the rear. Um, we got second to Rudolph in the redraw. Just car looks good, but not the motor we need right now. But it's fine. We're in the redraw. <sighs> If he's feeling lucky, so we'll see. Go ahead. No pressure. Great. Great. All right. You did all right. <laughs> Told Robbie we can keep him for the rest of the week, but apparently he's got to go back to work. So, damn me, Robbie. But nice job drawing. Nice job drawing. It's better than. His skills. I'm good. <laughs> So we got 40 laps starting um, 
for that. And I am going to go get us our feature lineup so we know where everybody is starting. Dale, you guys need to turn lights on over here. We are there. 40 laps. There's the lineup. Changing strategy for the first time tonight. I don't know. We're back at the point. 
We had time. No. Fast paced night, you know, there was rain in the area, but uh, smart for him to push it along. I did sprinkle a little bit as we were loading the car. And I uh, want to thank uh, all the Body Alley guys uh, for helping us load up a little quicker, uh, beat the rain. And well, it's not raining now, but um, you know, it just feels good to uh, get an iron under our belts after the, the small block engine issue. We, you know, brought the big block out tonight and wrong racetrack. Should have had the big block yesterday at Boot Hill where there was bite and then uh, here it was slick. But uh, we were able to get seventh, so it wasn't too bad. And uh, just hanging on, not not a lot of grip for us, but uh, I, didn't, I didn't feel like I had a terrible car. Um, but uh, just a, you know, high pace momentum track and, and uh, interesting, you know neat place and always cool to go and go someplace new and meet new people and uh art and lance are really digging hard they're uh, probably wearing them out <laughs> but probably really, three more nights really want to thank them for for all their hard work and and mandy too and um just uh the, the f it's a lot of work to do this week so um did get a nice dinner today, uh, lunch, whatever you want to call it. I was like, we had we dinner? Had nice, I, had I bought a, you a burrito. We had a nice lunch, finally, and then... More uh, Mexican. Um, 
Manny got her Frito Frito pie. Pie. That was good. Yeah. So, uh, well, we didn't get as muddy as yesterday, so maybe we could, you know, regroup and go to the Rev tomorrow and see what that's all about. So, what did you guys think of tonight? Better than I, last I night. Don't, I, not, not, <laughs> I don't know as a driver, but I really like the shape of the track and I like the banking. You like the banking or you don't? The banking. No, I like the banking. You like the banking? What's the driver think of the track? A little slick. What's the driver think? I don't know. One more track. I like the track. It just got slick for, for, the, for the combo we had, you know, which we had a small block for the... Well, All I want to see is how serious this wall is that Tyler Siri hit. Well, it's like metal? See metal? The football thing, all right? Yeah, full front hook. But it didn't move. I'll be damned. So anyways, so uh not too shabby finish your one piece on to the rev tomorrow. Head back to our hotel for the evening. And off we go for day number three. Now I don't think any of us have been there, right? Nope, nobody's been there. Fresh meat. Yep. Can't wait. It's gonna be great. So uh yeah. Make sure you like the video, subscribe to the channel, subscribe to newsletter down below, head over to Patreon, become part of the team, and we will catch you guys again tomorrow for day numero 